Hello, YouTube! It's Bar321 here, back with another Pokemon Sword and Shield Crown Tundra video. So before we get started, don't forget to destroy that like button and subscribe to the channel if you're new for more Pokemon content. And don't forget to turn on notifications so you get notified every time I upload an awesome new video. And let's get into today's video. Today, I'll bring you guys my second shine, legendary shiny from a Dynamax adventure. If you guys haven't already seen the Suicune, Go check that out. The link to that video is in the description. So, yeah, uh, we just caught the Tapufini in a uh, dive ball. And now let's go check out the Pokemon. So, Malamar not shiny, Azumarill not shiny, Morpeko not shiny. But there it is, an epic shiny Tapufini. And this was only my second or third Tapufini raid. I was just doing a couple of raids on a stream uh i was actually a friend of the channel mr cj uh he it was on his stream that i got this so big shout out to him his uh stuff the links to his stuff are in the description but yeah i've been hunting lugia and i decided to take a break to uh, do a couple other raids and i ended up with this little guy so yeah let's go and uh save uh, of course and now let's go ahead and uh check it out it's, it's such an awesome shiny and this is actually the first time you can shiny hunt the tapus they were given as part of an event for i believe it was ultra sun and ultra moon but this is the first time you can actually go ahead and shiny hunt them so yeah there it is and let's go check it out so it has four ivs which it's guaranteed to have and a neutral nature with the ability misty surge it's a really awesome looking Pokemon. I like what they did with the color pattern and the dive ball fits the light blue hair parts, I would call that, and the back part on the outside of what I would call a shell, I guess. But yeah, it looks so awesome. It's, it's definitely an awesome Pokemon. So let's go ahead and take it out of its Pokeball and see what it looks like in the overworld. Uh, since we can now have Pokemon follow you after the Isle of Armor, link to a video on that in the description as well. So, yeah. And there it is. It looks so awesome following me. It, it, it appears to be one of the slower Pokemon. It doesn't seem to be able to catch up to me very well, but still looks really awesome. I wish there wasn't the Blizzard, though, but yeah. I think that's going to be where we wrap up this video. If you guys have enjoyed and have gotten some epic shinies of your own, please don't forget to drop a like and consider subscribing to the channel if you're new for more Pokemon content. Thanks so much for watching, and I'll be seeing you in the next one.